She was close to being broken by the time she went to the White House. This is the earliest existing house. They lived here through the 1830s and 1840s. She was educated and she had taught school. Eliza would read to him in this shop while he worked making suits for the men of town. The North and the South fought over the occupation of Greenville all through the Civil War. It changed hands over 26 times. Andrew and Eliza did purchase slaves, so they did have domestic help. It was used as a hospital. It was used as a place to stay. And it was basically destroyed. Eliza being ill with tuberculosis wasn't able to get out much. Eliza received many gifts that she brought home with her. This is the room she returned to after their years in the White House. She's just obscure as she probably would have wanted it, but she's who he needed. <laughs>